Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how to use UAV in Armour 3 Beta development build. Um, first thing you want to do is choose any map. I'm playing on Stratus. Uh, and then you want to double click and go, I don't know, I'll go blue 4 for this one. It's important that you go to. Oh, man, I'll just. You have to go as a UAV operator. That's important. Uh, and then I'll spawn him. What? Oh, okay. He's my player. There we go. Okay. And now we'll spawn a UAV just here. And I'll make it blue 4 as well. That's important. Doesn't work if you go empty. You need to choose a blue 4 one. So we've got the Greyhawk. Um, Alright. I'll spin this around though, so it's facing the other way. Alright, there we go. Now we'll go preview. Yeah, it's good to spawn it on the end of the runway here, so then, because uh, they automatically taxi to a runway and take off. If you do it right here, that'll be the quickest way of doing it. So you want to run up to it and go connect terminal, terminal to UAV. Go wherever you want. Let's go here. Take, uh, we'll go open UAV terminal, and now we can see here you've got the camera and it's got details of speed, altitude, and the position. Um, and now we'll give it some instructions. So if I left click, uh, let's say over here at AGM Arena, it's starting up now. And if I right click, I can tell it what I want it to do. So I'll do. Uh, hold and I'll do never fire and altitude can be low profile so now it's automatically going to go and take off as we can see she's off and she'll follow that path so this is all automated you just tell her what to do and it'll go and do it uh, if it can find targets like vehicles the designator will spot them and fire at them if you tell it to um, and here's two cameras showing you where it is and I can go take control and now I'm flying it um, and I can fly this wherever I want so yeah It only comes with six missiles, and then you've just got tons of flares. G to deploy the flares, and left click to fire the missiles. You can then go on to uh, uh, the turret controls, which is more like a spotting thing. It'll give you a range. Uh, and now, because I've taken to the turret, the autopilot has taken over and is now flying the course that I gave it. Uh, I can go release UAV controls and it'll go back here and continue uh, circling the area where I told it to go. See right here. Uh, and then if I want to get it to land, uh, I'll go take controls, landing autopilot, and it'll bring it down. I'm not doing anything now. It'll bring it down itself. That doesn't look so good, but I think it's alright. It knows what it's doing. Uh, and it'll land me down here on the wrong way over there. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, it's the same deal with the... Uh, they're like, I don't know what they are. They're like little automated robot tanks or whatever. They're just one of them's got a machine gun on it with a grenade launcher. And yeah, you can just have a play around. It's good fun. And also, you can press N to change between night vision and then you've got infrared in black oh it's heat heat sensing in black and white it's neat all right have fun guys